Welcome to The Feature. I'm Marielle Serpiga. Today we will examine the prices of textbooks on college campuses. To look into this issue further, we sent Carmine Sprio over to Iona College. This is Iona College, a small institution located in New Rochelle, New York. Inside the Robert V. LaPenta Student Union is the Iona College bookstore. Here at the bookstore, prices of books are astronomically high. Human Resource Management, $154.50. Abnormal Psychology, $123.80. Macro Scale and Micro Scale Organic Experiments, $138.85. What's going on here? Prices of books can range from as low as $10 to as high as even $200. To discuss this issue, we met with Stephanie Logan, bookstore manager who gave us insight as to how the books are priced at the store. Well, the original um, pricing is set by the publisher. The publishers do set the list prices. Um, and those list prices are based um, partially on the cost of materials um, to simply produce the, the books themselves. There's also royalties that go to the author. Um, and there's a, a great deal of the cost of textbooks are going through um, copyright costs. Um, when that list price comes to me, a lot of times I do get a discount. And I never mark it up above list price if I've gotten a discount. Um, if the publisher doesn't extend to us a discount, however, we do um, a small markup simply to cover our overhead expenses here, uh, rent for the building, payroll, things like that. Okay. Um, but primarily those prices are set by publishers as list price. While the bookstore says one thing, the student body says something else. Meet Michael Ryan, an Iona College senior. The bookstore sells them for more than they're usually priced, so I'll try to get used ones. Mr. Ryan has been buying and selling books for four years. While he doesn't like the prices, he has found a way to get around the bookstore. Sometimes I'll try eBay, but I don't trust eBay as much. And I'll even go with uh, used books that other students use in the past. Despite the fact that students can return books, they often receive a rate lower than what they paid for. How do you decide prices for buying back books? Um, those are based on whether or not we have an order for the upcoming term. Um, right now we're buying books for the fall semester. Um, and if we have a professor's order for the fall, then we're able to give 50% of the book's shelf price back to the student. Um, if we do not have that order, the, the price that we give is based on national demand. Those books are going back to a, a national distributor and they usually pay between 15 and 20 percent of the book's shelf price um, depending on whether there's a demand for it elsewhere in the country. This is Kareem Marbrook, an Iona College sophomore. Mr. Marbrook was a former employee of the bookstore who gave us some inside information on the methods of the store. When you were an employee of the bookstore, did you receive an employee discount? We don't really get employee discounts. Um, as far as money-wise, like we don't get less money on the books. However, there's other advantages for working at the bookstore. Like, uh, obviously, you're gonna know what books are out before everyone else. Um, you know, so that's the advantage of that working at the bookstore. On the other hand, we get we get discounts on the clothing, um, all the other, other items, except for the books. Just because the books, we don't we don't have control over them. It's the company that owns them, and we just sell it, and so we don't get the discounts directly on them. We went with Mr. Marbrook as he sold back his books to his former employer. Come on, make it good. Three dollars. Three dollars. Wow. How much did these books originally cost? Yeah. Well, these are like little ones. I mean, that's like actually. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we have to use those. Yeah. All right. I guess that money will do him good for the next couple of weeks. Prices may never change, but hopefully, for students, things can be worked out. If not, you could always buy a nice Iona shirt. Reporting for the feature, this is Carmine Sprio. Hopefully for students, prices will go down in the bookstore in the future. For Carmine Sprio, I'm Marielle Serpico signing out.